First, make sure you've correctly stripped the wires to the proper length. Inside of the butt splice, you will see an indentation that your wires should butt up against. Make sure that the butt splice and the wire insulation are touching to reduce the risk of damaging the wire. So the stripped wire is inserted into one side of the butt splice and crimped with the proper tool. This crimp bends the connector around the wire creating a solid connection. Now, you can either repeat the process on the other side or crimp the other end creating a dead end. Before you heat it, don't forget the tug test. Once your wire is properly crimped, apply heat to the butt splice working outward. Be careful not to burn the butt splice or the wire insulation. And now you've created a durable, environmentally protected connection. Remember, butt splices are useful for their rapid installation and durability. Other methods of connection just don't offer the same level of protection.